Yasmin, you've heard of Jason Travis, love J Trav, him. don't you? Yeah, I love his Instagram page. It's amazing. And he's in the studio. Did I just give it away? There he is. Yeah, well, <laughs> hey, let's get to it. And let's show everybody what we're talking about. J Trav here, and we'll show some of your work before you dive in. Instagram, uh, you got the, the budding, growing following because your stuff is so unique. And, and you bill yourself as a guy, and we'll ask you about this coming out, who can take us to an event with one image, the photographer, uh, degree in design, so he has that eye. So he went to Dragon Con recently and took us there with his images. Let's watch. We're at Dragon Con, one of the most colorful, eclectic events in the universe. What I'm gonna do is take a bunch of pictures, try and find that perfect one that really makes you feel like you're here with me. And what I like to do is take pictures. Just capture the single moment. It really tells the story for me. And there is just a million moments to capture. Oh, okay, they're really going for it. So there you go, there's uh, Jason at uh, Dragon Con. Seems like you have fun. And yeah, this is you I have, just oh, let it loose, right? Um, yeah, pretty much. It's I mean, it's all spontaneous. I show up. I don't I don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> and then uh, you know, I'm looking for that kind of what's what speaks to me and what what I could show to everybody. And, and tell me about that. I mean, that that's quite a task or quite a goal to take us with one image to an event like Dragon Con or wherever you go. Is that really what you have in your mind? Um, yeah, I mean, that that event is so colorful. It's it's not really, you know, I'm kind of looking for um, you know, what could be the most interesting uh, you know, what, what's the most colorful? I don't even know. What to, I, I don't know what well, I'm going Well, and that, that speaks to how difficult it can be, right? <laughs> yeah, what, it can be You don't know difficult. what's going to come at you, especially at something like Dragon Con, mm -hmm. where, like you said, there's color and characters, uh, all, all things like that. Do you know when you're at an event and you take that shot, do you know, like, that's it? That's the one that captures the Some, event? Sometimes. I mean, I think there can be multiple images that can really, you know, speak to everyone. But, uh, there, there's, yeah, there are the moments that you kind of call out, and you're like, yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. There's that's a the smile. <laughs> there it is. That's it. Well, let's take a look at another one. You went, All right. And, and in the South, well, really across the country, we love our high school football. So you checked out high school football here I, uh, in Atlanta. I went to my high school, actually. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. So you had a little heart for what was going oh, on yeah. there. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. well, let's check it out, uh, and we'll talk about what uh, his takeaway was uh, coming out of a high school football game. We're here at Parkview High School in Wilbur, in Georgia. It's chaotic, man. We're the season opener. What I'm here to do today is to capture one image that really sums it all up. Cheese fries. I took a bunch of shots here tonight at the football game. It's all about the spirit. So for me, the winner is the crowd shot. So there, the crowd shot brought it home, right? Yeah. The spirit of the event. Yeah, all the kids having a blast, you know? Uh, I don't know. For me, that really it was it was the most uh, inspiring to me. I think to to feel that uh, camaraderie. You know. How do you how do you pick an event? I mean, obviously you're going to get Dragon Con and, and high school football. Those are two great events that have spirit and color, yeah. pageantry and all that. Is that part of your decision making? Um, I think we've been like brainstorming on different different things to capture and different places to go. Um, you know, there's a couple more we're going to explore pretty soon. Uh, in the works right now. You know, I mentioned at the outset, you've got a growing fan base on Instagram. Love your images, the different yeah. things you do. Uh, what, what makes your stuff unique, you think? And you think, huh? Uh, I'm always looking for, you know, color, composition, lighting, you know, interesting things that can be, uh, you know, like something I've never seen before. That's, that's what I'm interested in. Uh, you know, I love materials. I just love, you know, I love color. It's, that's what's fun to me. Let's, let's, um, let's backtrack one picture. Mm -hmm. You mentioned materials. Mm -hmm. And it's a portrait. It's a helmet with sprinkles on it. I don't know if we could show everyone that again. <laughs> there it is. So uh, how'd you come up with that? Oh, uh, that, that I was working on a project that involved donuts, and you know, one too many sprinkles led to one thing. One thing <laughs> led to another, and uh, next thing I know, I'm gluing, uh, you know, sprinkles to a football helmet. I love it. So, so yeah. a sugar high led to this creativity. Yes, is that right? pretty much. Yes. Who doesn't Who doesn't love donuts and cupcakes? And color, right? Love it. Yeah. And, and I'm sure everybody, last one real quick. Mm -hmm. So what do you do for a living? I mean, you have, uh, you take us to events with the one image. Yeah. You make some money. Uh, I'm a photographer. There and you go. I went to school for design and that's, uh, yeah, I'm running around with the camera basically 24-7, just mm. capturing it all. You sure do. Yeah. Got a, what a gift. Thank what you. a talent. Check it out. Jay Trav uh, on Instagram. Be one of the uh, growing fan base here. Unique images. Taking us there with the one image. <laughs> nice job. That's quite a gift. The smile says it all.